hi friends you're most welcome back to my channel if you're new you're welcome and if you're old you're super welcome all right guys check below you see the subscribe button click on the subscribe button and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to ring the notification bell green 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 so that you'll be the first to get notified anytime i upload a new video all right guys so today i want to talk about like will i call it disturbing i don't know like the real title to give it but it's so disturbing because you know there were screenshots of messages that came up, you know, trending online that um, Erica fans, I don't know that there's a group, that there's a group that was set up, you know, by Erica fans um, and they were plotting, you know, against Lacon, Nengi and Neil. Oh my God, like, really? Really? Like, I just pray, you know, this fan thing don't become something else. All right, so let me read it for you guys. This is the plot. They say, report that Nene stuck too. Even new. Report all of them. Yes, so the other person replied. The other person said, report that Nene to all of them in that effing stupid Lacon family. If I ever see their stupid tax on my trend list i am reporting it all the other person said they are mad the other person said what rubbish so they continue this one said report even go tv the other one say con is go tv ne is dstv so i said report them neo is speedy weight loss then the other person said this is a time to repay all these mofos they are all mad i will keep reporting all of them oracle venom also Plastic and corn report anything associated with them henceforth. This other person said report them. Neil is speedy weight loss. Yes, I'm imagining Neil is even trending. <laughs> Orange. This other person said I have reported all of them, including chess. That's the spirit. We don't turn it, you know, to become something negative. You know, this is how things start and start and start before you know they're turning it into a cult. Even Erica herself would never want such a thing. She will never want, you know, anybody to hurt anybody because of her. She's not that kind of person. And I don't think any of the housemates will want that. And I know that Erica has genuine fans like good people that will not even want this kind of thing so that something is telling me that maybe they just did it you know screenshot some things claim is a group chat you know just to blackmail erica and her fans or maybe something like that is actually existing maybe some evil people just want to disguise you know under the canopy or should i say umbrella of erica's fans elite to start causing harm and destruction which is really really bad you know something good can be hijacked you know once it's hijacked they now turn it to something negative just like the NSAS protest was hijacked by hoodlums at the end of the day they now turn it into something else it now became something very destructive why i'm like talking about it with so much passion and i'm like people should be careful this fan thing is supposed to be something very very good yes because at the end of the day it's your fan base that keeps you in the house it's your fan base that sustains you outside the house and it's also your fan base you know that brings luck in terms of endorsement and all that so it's something very very good and it's something that everybody wish for even if you are not um a big brother niger housemates once you are into social media stuff you know even if you're not a celebrity once you post your picture you see many comments you see many likes that kind of like boosts your service even a little oh my god like this picture is cool can you imagine it has 50 likes it has 100 like it had 1000 likes that's so difficult for someone who is a celebrity anyway it's kind of like boost your self-esteem and people are always excited about that so everybody wants um you know fan base everybody wants people who love them genuinely and yeah and we see that for big brother niger housemate we see that you know i didn't really know prior to this time i didn't really know that nigerians has so much passion i feel this thing was just the white people thing they are so passionate about this person celebrity you know they see celebrities and they're like crying i'm like 
<laughs> these people don't have problem but with big brother ninja i have seen unusual passion from fans to their faves and i'm like oh my god this is just on another level and it's something i admire a lot because even me as a youtuber you know i see some faithful fans of people coming back over and over again not in this channel in the other my pidgin english channel that has over 70 something thousand subscribers i see people coming back over and over again and i'm like seeing them as family in a way and i have like this love for them and all that and it gives me joy you know and i it makes me even want to do more sometimes even if i don't want to upload video i feel pressure oh my god they are waiting for upload and all that i feel pressure because i feel okay there are people i need to upload you know they need to watch and all that they need to know this thing that's happening and they, they, they need to hear my own perspective and all so something of joy so they are now you know trying to like hijack this thing or maybe trying to maybe evil people trying to do it to black make erica or maybe um a group of people trying to disguise as erica fans you know to cause evil is not really cool and what has lakon what has Neo, what has nengi done to anyone what have they really even done to erica you know to warrant such even if i don't know it's totally unnecessary you know these things can this things can really go far because something like this has happened before you remember tupac and notorious big this was what caused their exits like their early exits from planet earth i am from here i am from there you know at the end of the day they started clashing they started clashing you know it became like a cult you know it became clashing they meet somewhere so something else i think um tupac you know passed on there were reports that it was people from notorious big's camp you know that went and you know ended his life so you see how these things can actually turn that is why it's very very important to always preach peace if you are someone like if erica you know nengi lakon and all of them they should always preach peace and i must applaud nengi for that because there's a video she made and she was like talking to her ninjas that please they should ignore there are a lot of things they should ignore they should not you know um react to everything that they should just um use as an example she doesn't react to everything Just leave leave all them we don't have to michelle said when they go low we go high so yeah we don't have to answer people yeah just ignore. Be like, be like me. Be like your queen. Ignore. Mm? Some things are really not, are really not necessary. Aye. But so if you, you know, uh, uh, you that you are the uh, figurehead, you know, you come out to like preach peace, you know, say these kind of things. Okay, end of the day, you see that things get a better turn. Messi came to that time, you know, I don't know. Messi have done so many things that <laughs> sometimes I don't know. I love her though, but she needs wisdom. There was a time she came up and like, oh, that um, Nicki Minaj fans, they fight for her. You know, her fans doesn't, doesn't fight for her and all that. So this is the video. Her armies are strong. Kim, Kim Kardashian. Yes. Why can I have such people? I've been doing everything good. I've been trying to. I'm, I'm working my up. I want soldiers. I want soldiers that will only be for me. I do not want to share you. You support what I do. Support who I love, and I'll support you and love you. And I will not. <laughs> yes, Miss Flora Shaw. She said, Babs, look at her. Even on Twitter, you dare not speak about Nikki. Are you mad? Flora, I. Eh? You. Who. Who. Born, who are you to talk about Nikki or Candy? No, ma do you get why? Why is my different? Don't oh, not say you're not this people. No, it starts from somewhere. Your fans doesn't fight for you. Like, who owes you? 
in terms of this fan base and all this everyone should be grateful you know for what they have even me i'm grateful for the subscribers i have and i'm so so grateful because at the end of the day nobody owes me anything nobody owes me any effing thing nobody nobody owes anybody anything so you you don't come out and like people should end their life because of you doesn't make sense Nicki Minaj, Bobo Tibo, this one, that one you yourself that you, you are saying people should do this, they should do that because of you what have you done for people? nothing you have done nothing for people and then you want people to do everything for you they voted for you, you went to the house, you won now you are boasting that you won you know, I went, I won you didn't win with your power People did that for you, were just there. You know, you didn't come out to like campaign. You, you were not outside to, you know, campaign, lead campaigns, do this, do that. You did nothing. You were just there and then Grace found you and then you won. And then you come out to say, I went there, I won. Okay, people have done this for you. They voted for you. You went there, you won. And now you, you, you are coming out to say, um, they should fight for you. Okay, what if this thing like turns into a riot and then at the end of the day, you know, uh, people begin to lose their life? It doesn't make sense. I think what um, all this um, Big Brother Niger has made, because I've seen that that is where unusual passion is. I don't even see people, you know, fighting like this for actresses, actors, and musicians. But with Big Brother Niger has made, it's on a different level, even though I know Whiskey and David o fans are kind of like most times they fight, they compare and all that. But with Big Brother Ninja Husband, it's just on a different level, you guys. So I will just like beg, appeal, you know, to some of the housemen, even though some might, many of them might not even watch this video. Try to, you know, um, make peace. Try to make your followers know that, no, 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 you are for peace. And that will go a long way. All right, so I don't know why most of them feel so entitled. Can you imagine Katrina came up and like, if you are here, you don't comment, you don't like my photos, I'm going to block you. Oh, please go ahead, darling. All right, so, so Katrina wrote, nobody is above blocking. You follow me, you don't like or comment, I block you, period. So apparently she was referring to Ozo because, I don't know, she just unfollowed Ozo. So what she means is that nobody is above blocking. Even Ozo is not above blocking. As if you do anyhow, you will definitely see anyhow. When you are not in good terms with Ozo's babe Nengi, so how do you expect Ozo, you know, to fly, you know, and start commenting or liking your posts? It's not, um, it doesn't happen that way most times. Block them. Block them. Like, who owes you anything? Even them coming to, you know, clicking, coming to your, your, your page, you know, to view your photos, you know, watch what you're doing. It also adds to your traffic. It also adds to your traffic, even though I know that once you post something and then many people like it and then you have many comments, it's gonna like go viral. But then, <laughs> it's better than nothing. It's better than nothing because they also, even if they're not commenting, even if they're not liking, they also, you know, view your videos, um, click on your pictures and that also increases the visitors you have and that goes a long way. So this period of entitlement, you know, most Big Brother Niger housemates just need to crop it out of their head, like crop, crop, crop it, like crop it, you guys, and know that nobody owes you anything and be grateful for what you have. Be grateful for what you have and that will go a long way. All right, my darling friends, thank you so much for watching. Stay beautiful. <laughs> Bye.